Okay, I just want to show you how to make a drawing box. I think that's going to solve your problem. Basically, uh, when you're on like a, any kind of worksheet or something where you want your students to be able to write on the paper, then there's a couple of different choices. So whatever part of the paper that I want them to be able to write on, let's say I wanted them to be able to write on this area, maybe to, like you were saying, just mark out things. So I just create a box over the area I want them to write in. And over here, I choose this, and I go down. And there's a couple of different things that allow the student to write on it. First of all, a show your work box. A show your work box will allow students to work to write on the paper, but then it allows the the teacher to put in a correct answer, which the students it will it will actually grade it, so they can write on it, show the work, but then you can grade it. So show your work box is really the answer is supposed to be like a you know a quick one or two word answer or you know a number and then you also have a show your work box for math and chemistry and that's for you know people that want to use like a, a equation editor and like do math or chemistry or something like that and then what you probably want is a drawing box and in a drawing box there is no correct answer now what it's going to do is it's going to automatically grade this drawing box as correct. So if you want them to be able to write on the paper and then not have it score it, then what you have to do is on the points, you have to put it to zero. So now it's going to grade it correct, but it doesn't really count any points, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so I hope this answers your questions. If you have any other questions, just feel free to email me. Thank you.